Hey, what is up everyone? Crew Danny and Puchoy Crew Alex. In this Muay Thai segment, we're going to teach you guys how to use the different types of knees we have in Thai boxing. So check it out. Okay, so the first knee, if uh, you guys watched our channel a few months back, we looked at the basic knees. I'm actually going to leave a link to those videos so you guys can check them out, go back and check out the basic knees. But today we're going to review just quickly, right, some of the knees we have. So um, the focus of this segment, I want to teach you guys how we train when we clinch. But first, we have the straight knee, right, which is the one that comes right to the stomach right here. Boom, that's the straight knee. Then we have the higher knee where we just point it on an angle into the solar plexus. Sometimes we hit right with the chest. So boom, right here, okay. We have the side knee, which is to the side. Sometimes we'll use the belly pad, boom, right here. And then we start clinching with those knees, okay? So as an example, Alex has me in the plum. So from here is gonna go straight knee, oy, side knee, oy, higher up knee, oy. We have the different types of knees that we can use at a distance and also when we're neck wrestling. Now, from the tie up, which is the clinch, that plum, what we also do is a different type of knee. This one is the curved knee, okay? This one, the curved knee, you would mostly use when you are in the clinch, when you're holding at a closer distance, okay? Because you need that to use the pull to get generating more power into that knee. So the curved knee now is gonna come to the side right here, Oy. sometimes on the pads, Oy. or just on the belly pad. Oy. And on the opposite side, same thing. Boing, again. Boom. Okay, so these are some of the basic knees we like to train when we practice. We do tie pad training or focus mitts. Now, another knee is also shuffling, right? So basically, it's almost like a pendulum step. So as he has me in the clinch, he's going to shuffle into the curved knee. Boom. And that gives that momentum to generate a little bit more power, right? But you have to make sure that you're tying up your opponent into the clinch. So from here, boom. And on the opposite side, Boom, and that is the curved knee. Sometimes we also use the shuffling step into a straight knee. So he's gonna clinch here. Boom, again. And sometimes we'll even use the pad. And to the curve. Okay, so whether you like to just absorb it on the focus mitts, on the tie pads, or directly on the belly pad, the bottom line is the knees that we use, we want to have two different distances. Number one, the longer weapons or medium range where the long knee, such as a straight knee, is going to shoot out at the distance of your punching range and from a tie-up position when we're in a clinch. All right, guys, so there you have it. Quick tutorial and just to show you guys some of the different knees we use in Muay Thai. Guys, leave us a thumbs up as well. Subscribe to this channel for more Muay Thai videos. Hope you enjoyed this content and we'll catch you in the next video. Take care.